Hey guys, Pav here, and I've got good news. The Galaxy Note 4 finally has a release date in the U.S. It, um, I found, uh, I've been keeping up to date with this one pretty much every day, looking for, um, information and stuff on the, the Galaxy Note. This is what I'm really interested in. I plan on getting on uh, the day it releases. Um, uh, CNET posted, let's take a look here. Um, the Galaxy Note 4 launch set for um, October 17th, and pre-orders start this Friday, uh, as my other phone goes off, um, which uh, the pre-orders start Friday, which is the same day that the iPhone 6 is set to release, which means that that's just one more um, kind of a blow that Samsung is trying to make to Apple because they, you know, constantly, they're constantly in this big feud between the two of them. So, um, I'm not surprised, um, uh, that the, uh, that they're doing pre-orders then. Uh, it's just one more thing that Samsung can do to pull, um, buyers, uh, to them instead of, uh, to Apple. Uh, but this also came with some uh, some other interesting things on it. Uh, let's take a look here. Um, it says uh, it says here that the comp that Samsung said uh, that Thursday, uh, that's it, which is today, uh, the uh, 18th, that uh, pre-orders will begin on Friday, which is tomorrow, the 19th, which is the same day as uh, the iPhone 6 uh, and 6 Plus. Um, it says here that Samsung will offer a guaranteed total trade-in of $200 on working smartphones that are swapped out uh, for the Galaxy Note 4 pre-order. Um, so, I mean, even it says here, you know, even if you have a really cheap uh, smartphone, you know, maybe you have, uh, you know, an old iPhone 4S still or, or an iPhone 4 or, or uh, uh, an old MyTouch. I mean, that, uh, the MyTouch was one of my first Android phones. Um, you know, even if you have something like that, they're still going to give you 200 bucks for it. So definitely a um, smart move on Samsung's part. That's going to uh, get a lot more people to where they can actually trade in uh, to, to come up with that that uh, that uh, first part of the money and everything that you have to have whenever uh, you're upgrading your phones sometimes. Um, let's see. Uh, what else do they have here? Uh, it goes into talking about the marketing and everything and some of the specs and stuff. Um, it says the Samsung Galaxy Note 4 will be available in black and white um, on AT&T, uh, AT Sprint, T-Mobile, Verizon, and U.S. Cellular. Um, I thought they were going to come out with a couple other colors, but um, I don't remember where I read that. Um, Anyway, it goes over some of the prices here. Like T-Mobile's off contract price is uh, roughly seven hundred fifty dollars. Um, T-Mobile said that they'll offer the device for no money down and payments at thirty one twenty four over twenty four months. Uh, thirty one twenty four over twenty four months. That's gonna come up to the C thirty one twenty four times twenty four. Right, right. Yep. Uh, that's seven hundred fifty dollars then. Uh, is their price point so um, keep going it says Sprint said that the Galaxy Note 4 will cost $30 a month for 24 months for a uh, total of $720 so it's a little cheaper through Sprint um, their two-year uh, contract price is $350 so if you're if you're due for an upgrade you've been holding off for the the Note 4 um, the 350 that's what you're going to be looking at uh, paying to with the with a new two-year contract um, through Sprint. Uh, AT&T has several options it says here for Note 4. It's 300 with the traditional contract, which is the traditional contract is your two-year contract. Um, so it's a little cheaper through AT&T to start with. Uh, it's 3442 under its AT&T Next 18 program. I'm not 100% sure what that is. I'm not real familiar with AT&T. Uh, seeing as how it's called Next 18, I'm guessing you pay that over 18 months. Um, which would put that if it is, let's take a look here, 3442 times 18. That's going to be 619. Um, so, yeah, I mean, that's close, but... Um, 
yeah, I'm not sure. Like I said, I'm not real familiar with uh, AT&T's stuff, so I don't know if that's what they are actually looking at there. If that's what that uh, AT&T Next 18 program is. Um, I'm saying 4130 under is AT&T Next 12. Um, so if I go 4130 times 12, that's 495. So yeah, I'm not I'm not sure what uh, what those are. That doesn't seem to be consistent with the other prices for the phone. So uh, if you're an AT&T customer, you're probably familiar with those programs that they have. Um, they did say, however, that the AT&T's off contract price is going to be $825.99. That's significantly higher uh, than T-Mobile. Uh, significantly higher. That's uh, that's like, let's see, that's uh, 30, 40 bucks more. Um, and, it, and it's not so much that it's just 30 or 40 dollars more. There's a, a big psychological thing, you know, when you go to pay for something, it's okay. Hey, I can get this for 750 here, or I can get it for 825 there. Even though that's really only like 75 bucks. Um. You know, which in the grand scheme of if you're paying that much money, isn't really that much. Um, it's, you know, you, you break that other hundred and that just adds a whole new dimension to it that people don't want to pay. Um, so AT&T uh, seems like they're, uh, they're, they're looking for a little bit more money for it. Um, it says here, CNET, uh, CNET contacted Samsung for comment and they'll update the store when they have more information. So there's not really a whole lot of information out. That's what's out right now. Um, yeah, so the, the Note 4 is launched for October 17th. Uh, Pre-orders start tomorrow. And um, yeah, so there we have it. Still no word on the release for the Note Edge. Um, I have Verizon myself. I'm going to be probably going through the new Verizon Edge plan, um, which makes it to where I can... Pay, you know, because I have a, a higher data plan. Um, I can pay, I can do the Edge program, and I get a twenty-five dollar discount. So I'm really only going to be paying an extra five dollars a month for the the Note Four. And as long as I have sixty percent, and, and that's over twenty months. And as long as I have sixty percent of it's originally thirty dollars, but I get the twenty-five dollar discount. So as long as I have 60% of the $30 paid out over 20 months, which is $600, so 60% of that's 360 bucks. As long as I've paid 360 bucks on it, at any time, I can upgrade to that Note Edge, and I intend on doing that. Um, so uh, definitely looking forward to that. If you are a Verizon customer, look into that. Uh, you only get that $25 if you have one of the larger data plans. So, uh, so yeah, this is Pav, guys. Uh, if you like the video, go ahead, throw a like and a subscribe down. Uh, if you have any comments, questions, or anything else, throw them in the throw them in the comments down below. Um, you know, feel free to tell me, you know, hey, why do you want which which one are you really wanting? Do you want the Note Edge? Do you want the Note Four? Um, which, which one is the going to be the phone for you, or are you uh, sticking it to Samsung and you're going to go get the iPhone? Whatever you're getting, let me know about it down in the comments. And uh, y'all take care.